Okay, hello everybody, and welcome back to The Witcher 3, where we're gonna maybe do the... the, 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 the <laughs> uh, should I start over? No, uh, or maybe we're gonna go kill Griffin. It's cool that, like, if you fight, like, specific monsters that maybe, like, the specific quests will pop up. I don't know. I like, I like the idea of, like, hunting, like, monsters, though. I really like that. Uh, quest. What do we have? Not that one. Beast of White Orchard. So that's it. Okay. Ask the hunter where he found the bodies. Roach. Flitzer. Let's go. Onwards! Onwards, horsey! You don't ever see peasants on horses, eh? They can't afford it. Back in the day, having a horse was like, like way back in ancient times, like having a horse was like the shiz. And like, people didn't know, because for one thing, people didn't know how to take care of them. Like, and even nowadays, I mean, you could look it up, but like, you just somebody handed you a horse, you'd be like, uh, uh I mean, you feed it and stuff, but like, even that was like, it was beyond the, the capacity of most peasants, uh, like lower class individuals, I guess, to, 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 to take care of one. And it was like mystical. It was like this magical being that only like high nobles could, I knew this was the hunter, <laughs> could, uh, hey there, hey there, hey there. If I get a horse someday, I'm going to say, hey there all the time. Oh. Anyone home? I lot. Oh. Must be out hunting. Must be out doing that hunter thing. Trails fresh. His love just left home. Okay, I'm like I, it, my I, my sensitivity is still like a bit weird. Like it's just very abrupt. What are you doing? You, Ms. Love. Shh. Oh, cool. Yeah, Tattoos. Wolves? No. Wild dogs. Yes. More dangerous than wolves. Oh. They are. They're like they're vicious, but let's uh let's do that. Dogs more dangerous than wolves? Don't think so. It's the truth. No why? No, but I guess you're about to tell me. <laughs> Wolves hunt to fill their bellies. Yeah. Wild dogs kill for sport. Just like humans. Aye. They've learned much from us. Ah. Why not cruelty too? Interesting. I'm hunting bigger game. The Nilfgaardians the Griffin killed. Where'd you find them? Ah, I see. You a witcher. That monster slayer they's talking about in the village. Mm-hmm. Mm. I'll show you, sure, but uh, I gotta kill those mutts before they hurt someone. Will you? Oh. Help? That is, if you don't mind blunting your silver blades on them. Why not? Sure, Griffin's not going anywhere. No, dogs might though. So step careful now. Come on. All right. Uh, dogs I will... been a problem for a while now. Since the war started. Soldier on the ah. march. He'll stop to rape a woman, strangle her, kill her man for a chuckle, even butcher a cow. But a dog, a kick in passing, no more. So these stray mutts form packs. They're gaunt, guts stuck to their spines, covered in scabies. But they just won't die, because they're clever. More so than foxes. And they hate men something fierce. Huh. I was quite... Quite, quite enthralled with that little tail. Are we going the right way? What's this glowy thing? Oh, I can, I can see the dogs over there. I'll have to use my Too silver late. sword. Attacked another one. What? Where? They're right there. Oh, uh, steel weapon. <laughs> Dodgy! Dodge! Aha! Holy 
Holy crap, these dogs look nasty. Shoot. I mean, oh, I can loot stuff from them. Raw meat. Oh, that would be good, though, probably. For my witcher stuff. That's really sad, though. I mean, it's... It, there was a story I read once about, like, a dog that, like, became possessed. Like, is a fictional story, you know? But his, his, his master woman had been raped and had committed suicide. And, um, the dog was so... So s sad, you know? Like, not sad, like, just... Torn to pieces, you know? Like, so, so torn up by that. I don't know. Huh. It's like a dog, like a dog's sadness, you know, and like they couldn't protect their master from somebody else or from themselves, you know, and this dog had like a basic idea of what had happened and it like became like possessed by like rage and anger and stuff and it became like a demon that had to be put down because it didn't just stop killing bad guys, it started killing innocent people too. It just got consumed and it was, it was really sad. Ew. Dieter. You know him? We served at the Lord's Manor together, where the Black Army's encamp now. He was a stable hand, I was the Lord's hunter. But that Interesting. Was well, a long time ago. Before what? Before what? Before they drove me from the village. Oh! What did you do? Nothing. I'm a freak. Sorry. I'd rather not talk about it. Oh! Maybe? I'm a freak too. <laughs> Aye. But of another kind. I think I know what this is about. I can help. Oh! What? Lycanthropy. Werewolves. Handled a few cases in the past. It's usually a simple curse that the Lord's son, Florian. <gasps> we loved each other. Oh, it's even more than I Dieter thought. They walked in on us in the stables. They drove me away. <gasps> Florian hanged himself. Oh my gosh. Lord started drinking and the estate fell into ruin. That's the long and short of it. Wow. Florian hanged himself? Like, I thought I was getting kind of the, like, vibe that maybe he was a dude that had loved a dude. Because that is, you know, it's a freak thing, especially in this time and, like, in this current, like, the medieval era, you know. It was not looked upon kindly by any means. Um, usually it involved death. I'm surprised this guy's still alive, to be honest. I'm sorry. Uh, ancient history now. Wow. I was to show you where I found the Nilf Guardians. Come. I mean, that's intense, this guy. And he was the Lord's Griffin, Hunter, like... Know anything about him? Oh, not much. Not my kind of game. That's You're a big title. Though. Survival instincts alone ought to make you care. I walk silent through the woods. No griffin can hear me nor spy me. Huh. Really? Are you that good? Are you... Are you... I wonder if he would have made a good witcher. Witchers are orphan kids, though, usually. Street wraiths that they... Street waifs that they pick up. At least that's the that's the theory. I think Geralt was given to the witchers by his mother, who, in the books, is a sorceress. Which I thought was really interesting. Like, not, like, super interesting, but it was like, oh, like, because you encounter her at one point, just briefly, when he's very, very sick. And, and it's like, wait, what? Wait, what? You know? <laughs> Twas here. One lay there, by the stump, headless. The other hung from a branch, guts splayed, stretching down to... Watch out for yourself now. Nothing no more, and they were Nilfgaardians. What? No. Does the Witcher... Does Witcher... <laughs> does Geralt not like Nilfgaardians? I don't know. I'll be fine. Not the first griffin I've dealt with. Not likely to be the last, either. Hope you're right. Good hunting, now. Take care of yourself, guy. They were... Wait. 
There's more wild dogs over there. Elf guardians were celebrating. Griffin interrupted them. Grounds black, saturated with blood. Uh huh. A camp. New marker, broken bridge. What? Oh, I like just walked close enough to it. Um. Oh. Somebody tried to run. These prints are older, and deeper, heavily armored. Elf guardians, probably. Wait, can I? I don't, I, it's hard to tell how far away they are. Well, there's something down there, but... When did this bridge break? Come on. Amateurs armor repair kit. Linen. Always useful. Can I jump up this? Nope. Well, how does one get across? Can I jump across? That was cool. Oh, this way. Oh. Oh, maybe not in Witcher sense I can't jump. Well, is this something else or what? Did you jump up here, person? Trying to lose tracks on the rocks, I think. Maybe? Um, nothing down, so I'll keep going up. Ha ha, I already did that. Okay. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. Griffin's okay, so nest. what remains of it at least? Oh. Oh yeah. Corpse is a couple of weeks old. Still alive when the Griffin brought him here. Took a long time dying. Shoot. Bones, horse, dog, human, a few months worth. Female, larvae and her wounds have already hatched, been dead at least a week. Other griffin must be a male. Deep cuts over the whole body. Not a drop of blood on the beak or claws. Didn't defend herself. Crept up on her while she slept. Oh my gosh. Beak tips worn. Gray hairs in the coat. 10, 12 years old. Griffins pair off for life when young. Male must be about the same age. He's gigging revenge. That's right. He's... He's gone mad with grief. Because his mate was killed on some stupid of guardians. Thick shaft, dense barbs. The royal griffin. Explains why the male I ran into was so aggressive. Hunted the Nilf guardians down here in the forest first, then started prowling the area. And then killed. Should talk to Vesemir. Shoot. 
Never underestimate your opponent. This rule is at the core of the Witcher's Code, and for good reason. Proper preparation has saved many a Witcher's life. It is likewise worth your while to brew potions, concoct oils, or visit craftsmen before engaging in combat. I do need to do that. Oh, blacksmiths can only do weapons while armorers craft armor. That's strange. I would assume a blacksmith could do both. If you expect to battle a strong opponent, you might want to complete some side quests before attacking. This will allow you to gain experience to develop your character, giving you a better chance. Well, we're level 4 now. This is really sad, though. Like, especially when it was, like, panned up, you know? It was, like, this majestic beast. Is it, griffins are beautiful creatures, and for the most part, it wasn't really bothering anybody. A pair of them weren't bothering anyone. And then... But then somebody came up and snuck up on it. Like... I don't know. While it was sleeping, like, that is just so freaking sad. I wonder if I could have examined the... This... Oh, can I? Hang on. Wait. Burned. Only a human could do this. Okay. So they killed the one that was here, and then... Burned the nest, because they were, like, all drunk and psychotic and... Good reason to not get drunk, so you don't go out and try to kill a griffin. Whoa. Magic split bolt. Magic gun. A book! Oh, Emir, yeah, yeah. Well, it looks like that's everything then. Let me get Roach up here if I can. I don't know. Well, actually, to get up here is quite difficult. Although maybe it will show me... Oh, what's what's over here? Okay. Right. Okay, I'll level up in a second, but I want to see what this is all about. Come on, Roach. I hear something. Place of power. That's what I thought! Whoa. Cool! The griffins were nesting next to a place of power. It seems a shame to... The other place was different. It had like flowers and everything. This one's got trees. It's beautiful. Oh, so I don't have to have the sign on. It's just telling me what sign it's gonna improve. Nice. Oh, and I still have that ability point from before too. Wow. That's very cool. Oh, so does it, does it does the sign intensity only work? Is it like a timer up there in the corner or something? That's kind of lame. But let's level up. I have 3 points available. Shoot. Oh, so I guess um Okay. When you unlock a level, do you unlock these or whatever? Come on, come on. Okay, there we go. Where are we going? I should probably get... Uh, I think I should do that. I was thinking earlier, I was like, well, like, why doesn't my vitality regenerate? And that's because I don't have that yet. You know what I mean? I don't have... Like, it doesn't, it doesn't regenerate unless you get... Unless you get the point. I kind of want that, but maybe we should... 
I mean, I've got a point in combat and a point in brand. I guess okay. I have three points, so I can I'll I'll mess around with something. Increases odds range by one. Yeah, I've been using Igni more. Woo! Oh, jeez. But the Griffin, I'm not sure what the Griffin is all about. Let's see. Oh, okay, so these you have to have multiple points. I see, interesting. Increases sign duration by five. Number of alternate mode charges, seven. Number of standard mode traps, one. Okay. Coin shield pushes opponents back when it breaks. That's nice. Ooh. Oh. <gasps> oh. Okay. It increases it in effectivity in dialogues too. Can I can I get it? Oh, I have to. Okay, we got one of those. That one also looks really good, but let's check out alchemy. Increases potion overdose threshold from 75 to 80. Okay. Event. Enables the brewing and drinking of witcher's potions. Enables the creation of oils. Bombs the mutagens. Okay. Oh, okay. Toxicity is about zero. Time automatically slows when an enemy is about to perform a counterattack. What? The enemies can perform counterattacks? Every known level one alchemy formula increases maximum toxicity by one. Oh, I got an achievement, by the way. Um, it was like, uh, it was a potion one. It was like, figure, like, learn 12 potion recipes or something. Time is slow to further 15% while aiming bombs. What is that? Potion duration time plus 5%. Oh, okay. Oh! Oh, but all of these increase the potion duration time. Okay, that's cool. Gives you a base ability, but then also stuff. Other stuff. Ooh, 3% chance of poisoning the target on each hit. Or, I haven't really been using bombs, but maybe I should, I probably should, eventually. I haven't really had, ooh, Trial of the Grasses. Interesting. I don't know about that yet, I haven't had a problem with it, so I'm not gonna worry about it. That's kind of tempting. Uh... Uh, maybe I'll do that? Oh, but we could- I mean, we could look at the further- further on down in the branch for stuff. Too. Oh my gosh! That's pretty good. Oh, wow! Imbibing a potion gives a 20% chance of activating the effects of another randomly selected potion. Interesting. Critical hit damage is increased. Okay. Cluster bomb. Oh, is this like unlocking different kinds of bombs? It increases the maximum number of bombs in each slot. That's nice. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's cool. Oh, wow. Oh. Increases bonus for mutagen. Wow. That increases your vitality by a lot. I think I might want to work down this line, though. Cause, uh, cause that's awesome, and that, that's really awesome. 
But, I mean, you need, like, a ton of points. Well, eight, that's not bad. So it looks like points aren't too difficult. I thought maybe you only got a point every time you leveled up, but you get a point when you do other things and, like, the, the places of power and stuff, too. That's cool. We'll get that one. And then... Oh, wait. Oh, okay, this is the mutagens. Okay. Um, but I do kind of want... I want that. Yeah. What does that one do? Deflect arrows while parrying. Okay, I, I probably don't have to worry about that. How can I take it off? Remove. Okay. Oh, I should have looked at combat stuff. Oh, dang it. Oh, well. <laughs> um... I got one in each ability, and maybe you should, like, specialize. I think it's a good idea to at least get one in each ability. Um, let's put that on. And... Should we put that on? Creases. Or that one. Maybe for the fight we'll put that one on. Oh! Oh, cool! So that's what, that's what I was saying, like, the mutagen will sometimes have an effect with, with the abilities that you put in. Okay, so you put the green mutagen in. I'm sure people, I actually haven't read the comments in a while. I've been very busy, and I'm out again of Witcher episodes. I put the, la the one that I did last night, I put up last night, so I'm recording some more for now. Well, for today. But, uh, okay. I'm sure some people have already tried explaining this to me. But I've been very busy this week. Got so, I got a pretty big announcement for this upcoming week, too. But hopefully it will it will mean good things. Okay. Interesting. So that's a relic. I'm not really sure what a relic is. As co a, as com like, a relic to me is like an object. Oh, and I have a trophy now, too. I wanna... Um, oh, and I got... What's that? <laughs> I don't know! Oh, I can eat? Can I cook raw meat? Because I don't want to eat it. Ugh. I have a lot of stuff. I have a lot of stuff! Oh, man. Oh, boy. Okay, compare is... That's what I... Oh, no. I have the Temerian sword equipped. So it's plus nine what? Damage? It's plus nine damage? I really need to sell some of these. Um... Okay, that's not so good. That's not so good. That's... Oh, do I not have... Do I have that equipped? I don't. But I put stuff on it. I put the... Oh. That's a really cool sword. What is... It's a... I mean, plus five... It's a magic item. It's at 72%. I could use that, but I don't, yeah, no, it's not that great anymore. That's a chance to cause bleeding, but this has an increase in the signs. That's pretty cool. Nice. Okay. I still have my same silver sword because there's, you don't, you don't really just pick up. Oh, okay, so I have the one for. Oh no, I use up that one, but this is to my armor gets damaged? Oh my gosh. What's my armor? Okay. Okay. Alright, we're doing okay and we're pretty good. Um Well I guess let's go talk to Vesemir. And I want to check want to check the map because there was something else kind of close by. I'm not sure what that is. I kind of want to go 
And while I'm out here, you know. <laughs> run, Roach. Run, Roach, run. What is it? Enemies! What are those? Are you humans? Oh, wait, Perry! No, I parried that! Didn't I parry? Oh! What did he. I am not rich. Did he call me rich? I dodged it! Whoa! Whoa! Oh, more guys! Did not see you! Whoa! Hey! What did I just do? Oh! Whoa! I put down. I forgot that I had that sign on. I'm used to having Igni on. Okay, well, I took care of those guys. Haha! -ha. Grilled pork, thank you! Red and a small blackjack! I'm, I, I notice I have like 30 out of 60 or whatever on my inventory. I'm like, don't you do, I'll just keep going. I'll sell that. Um, I can put out that. I can put out that. Turn it off. We don't need that. Where you at? Lootable. Okay. Are these, these are deserters from the Novograd army. Interesting. Oh, they just have stuff. It's like... Ooh, what's that? They had a ton of beer, trying to drink their sorrows away. Oh my gosh, I have so many runes, too. Oh my gosh! Superior beast oil! I don't even know what all this does. I don't even know! Why do they have alchemist powder? Cow's milk. Thank you for the loots. So bandit caps will have loot. That makes sense. Oh wait, was there something else? Yeah. Oh, they had something under the tables. Oh, they're storing it like they're put. They're like their storage stuff is like their platform for their little camp. I like that. That's kind of cool. I mean, I think it'd be kind of hard to get to, but if it was stuff you didn't need, like immediately, that's a pretty good idea, and it keeps it pretty safe. I'll have to remember that when I'm camping. <laughs> Just stick everything under my 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 tent. I actually have a raised tent. It's a, it's a cot tent, actually. A two-man cot tent, so it's basically a cot and the tent on it, uh, and it's really nice. I like. I actually haven't. I just bought it recently. I haven't. I haven't um, used it, but I'm gonna be using it soon. <laughs> uh, okay, go talk to. We gotta go talk to Vesemir. That's it, Roach. We're coming. So, can you come back to these? The other one looked like it was. Um, Medallion's humming of power it's got to be so it is a timer it looks like up there but it looks like it increases any sign or no it was just Quinn okay it looked like Axie for a second um, so you can come back that's cool but yeah. it, you, you probably don't get let me let me just check I'm just gonna check you don't you don't get an extra ability point but okay yep so you can come back to these and get your sign your signs re-increased or whatever. That's cool. 